Hello everyone, this is Lydia and this is a video response for Bethany. She is BA Crafty Girl here on YouTube. She is hosting a Halloween slash fall challenge. Your project is due by October 10th. You must be a subscriber. The colors you have to use are um, purple, black, orange, white, and green. You have to use two stamps, washi tape. It can be any project, but it must be a new project. And you have to create a video response and link it to her video. Hi, Bethany. Thanks for the fun challenge. So let me show you the products that I use. It's amazing how many um, items I used, products I used to create one small note card. <laughs> the note card measures four and a half by three and a half, and it's Halloween theme. So I used my Spellbinders, Nestabilities. This is the Lazy Ovals, and I used the largest the largest die, which measures approximately four and a half by three and a half. I used some glitter in red. Here's one of the stamps I used, just a little note. Here's the second stamp. Have a bloody good Halloween with Dracula. I used the stays on for um, the ink to um, stamp out the images. This is the washi tape I used and I believe this is um. My Mind's Eye from the Indie Collection. For my adhesive, I used this Tombow Mono Permanent Adhesive that I received from Jenny, Scrapping Jenny in a Rack. Thank you, Jenny. My Tim Holtz Distressor. I love this using that tool. I used an index card. Purple cardstock, just regular cardstock. It might be recollections. For the papers, I used this um, paper pad here from We Are Memory Keepers and it's the Spookville collection. It has some really pretty prints. And I used one of the little die cut pieces here. One of the little um, tag pieces and some of the papers. I used the polka dot. And the polka dot paper has all the colors in her challenge. Purple, black, orange, white, and green. They're all there. And then I used this one for the back of the note card. And for an embellishment, I used some flowers and one of these fabric um, brad things that I received in a rag from Natasha. Thank you, Natasha. Actually, it was some winnings. So here's my card. Like I said, it's very small. It measures just four and a half by three and a half. So there's the purple cardstock. And for the paper, what I did, since I don't have an over, oval stamp, I just um, placed the, the die on the paper, and then I used my X-Acto knife to cut around it. And it leaves a nice little space right here, so I like, I like the look of that. So here's the um, Spookville paper with all the colors, and here's a little piece, the Beware piece. I distressed it, and I ripped the edges here. So that's the little card from the collection. And here's a flower my sister sent me in a rag. Thank you, sis. And I used some black soot on that. Now, this flower here I created using the washi tape. So here's the washi tape, and there's the flower I created. There's that um, fabric button that I received from Natasha. And here's the first stamp, just a little note. And I used some um, shabby shutters distress ink around it, around the edges, and I created a banner. Here's another flower, and there's a little black flat back pearl there that I re that I purchased from um, Beady Bomb Bomb Creations, um, Elizabeth. Her store, so there's the, the note card. I think it turned out super cute. And then you open it up, and inside, if I can open it up, inside is the this paper here, I can't think of the name of it now, it just went blank. The index card, and then I stamped the, um, this is my second stamp. Dracula, have a bloody Halloween, and I just added a little glitter around his mouth to make it look like he just had a bite. He just had a snack. And then, here's the back. I still have to stamp it and date it. So that's my entry for Bethany's challenge. Thanks for watching everyone. Post comments if you wish, and subscribe. Have a fabulous day. Bye.